Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. We are discussing 2022 UPSC mains. We have already discussed 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So we are in the ninth question of geography that is about troposphere. Right? It's a very significant, I think everyone, even a child knows it is very significant. Atmospheric layer determines weather process. This you have to concentrate. Yes, you can prove in a at least half pace drawing this diagram or in a first place drawing this diagram that troposphere is important layer because all the life exists here, all the mountains, plateaus, beauty, plains, you know, uh, you know valleys, and sea, seabed, everything lies in the troposphere, all the life uh, is from 0 to 12 to 18 kilometers. What is this 12? It is poles, it is 12 and equator, it is 18 kilometers, all the communications, I mean, all the aeroplanes, you know, passenger planes do travel here. We have started so much with Thomas Bay Expert. You don't need to mention about that. Concentrate, stick to the topic because don't waste your time. It's better not even draw this uh, diagram. Just mention the names, Tatomiso, Thermo, and Exo. So, significance you have to write. You know, the life starts here, the agriculture starts here, the biota starts here, the vegetation starts here, the, uh, you know, the crab, the, the, all the bad things do start here, the good things start here. You can write all those significance. But, atmospheric layer that determines the weather pattern this you have to concentrate how you have to prove it it is not just saying you have to prove it for example 8 kilometers of the poles 18 kilometers of the equator it depends 12 to 88 and all right so heated air rises to the great heights this is where the logic is whenever there is a heat more heat air rises up when air rises up it goes to the top uppermost point that point itself is called as troposphere Right. So here, because this is troposphere ending, the clouds formation, the rainfall formation as conventional, the moment of wind called as westerlies or easterlies winds, the winds that come down as pressure winds or hot air masses, every phenomena that is happening in troposphere, how it is impacting the climate, how it is impacting you know, world trade and not just trade, rainfall, minerals, everything you can mention about that drop 5 degrees per kilometer. These are the characteristics in the first half thing you have to write, which is 4 minus 45 at the poles, minus 80 at the equator. Those are convectoration. This is a convectoration. This you have to stress in the next style. I am showing that. See, look at here. You are here. Right? So, all the air rises up. So, all the rainfall do happen. That we call it as Hadley cell. For example, now uh, imagine this is um, 0 degrees. All the air that rises up gives rainfall, the wind, troposphere, I said 18 kilometers, here it is 12 or 8 kilometers, depends upon the temperature, it goes up and down, so from the top, the uppermost, from 18 kilometers, it comes down, it comes down as Hadley cell, so the wind that again comes back to equator is called as trade winds, which is used for trade, even now it is used for trade, for same fuel, so we have feral cell, Polar cell, I have already made a special video on that. I will give the description on the link description, the difference between Hadley cell, Feral cell, Polar cell. But here you are not mentioned, you are not required to mention the complete stuff, but at least one diagram of this. The importance that it creates, the conventional things, the rainfall, on rainfall rivers, from rainfall rivers, everything. You can mention as two to three points here. This particular point is very very important the cloud formation convert to current this is the troposphere this you have to mention this shows that you know the concept this shows that you can apply to that maximum desired application and show to the examiner that i know the concept i know the concept which you are focusing on i know everything it's just time that is limiting me and i'm giving you my answer shortcut this is how you have to get marks Actually, as I said, don't mention about this thing, but one diagram will suffice everything. All these convective currents happen in troposphere. So, the easterlies, the westerlies, the monsoon, the jet stream, you know, the burst of monsoon, the what not, man, trade winds, everything happen in the troposphere only, you know. You can mention that. So, this is uh, one more topic that I want to discuss. In the 10th video, the last video, I will be discussing on uh, relationship between globalization and new technology. Stay tuned to our channel. Thank you.